1928. Mold spores drift in the wind across the London rooftops. They blow in the second floor window of St. Mary's Hospital, the laboratory of Alexander Fleming. Here, we're told, occurred one of the greatest medical discoveries of all time, penicillin. A fluffy white mass, which increases rapidly, inhibited some species of bacteria. Today, we fear cancer and heart disease. Then, it was bacterial infections, meningitis, pneumonia, tuberculosis were words of doom. When penicillin became a medicine, the world changed forever. Alexander Fleming received most of the public credit for the miracle. But Fleming's laboratory notebooks reveal that he quite quickly abandoned work on penicillin, convinced that it would never work in living tissue. Then, 12 years later, as the Second World War began, three scientists at Oxford mastered penicillin's fragile structure and produced the greatest medicine in the history of mankind. <laughs>